In this problem, we're told that acetone, the main ingredient in nail polish remover, has a density of 0.786 grams per milliliter. We want to calculate the volume in liters of 243 grams of acetone. To solve this problem, we will need to use the density of acetone as a conversion factor. Remember, density can be used as a conversion factor between grams of a substance and milliliters of that same substance. The conceptual plan that we will use to solve this problem is the following. First, we'll convert from grams of acetone to milliliters of acetone using its density. And then we'll convert from milliliters to liters using the relationship that one milliliter is equal to 10 to the negative 3 liters. Since we're using two conversion factors, we'll need to create two sets of parentheses. And we'll start with our given measured quantity of 243 grams. In our first step, we want to convert from grams to milliliters. So we'll place the unit of milliliter in the numerator and the unit of grams in the denominator. This will allow the units of grams to cancel. In our second step, we want to convert from milliliters to liters. So we'll use the unit of liter in the numerator and the unit of milliliter in the denominator. This will allow the units of milliliters to cancel, giving us a final unit of liters. Now we'll plug in the numerical values associated with each unit. From the density, we know that one milliliter is equal to 0.789 grams of acetone. And we also know that one milliliter is equal to 10 to the negative 3 liters. Notice that the units of grams cancel out, and the units of milliliters also cancel out, leaving us a final unit of liters. When we perform the following mathematical operation, we get a calculator answer of 0.30798 liters. Taking into account the rules for significant figures, we round our answer to 0.308 liters.